I'm Morty Forage, and this is Overexposed. Do role-playing games lead to Satanism? Many experts think so. Our own field reporter, Douglas Hanston, took to the street for himself to look at the grim world of dungeons and dragons. Hi. I'm in your typical all-American neighborhood here, and it's in neighborhoods like these all around America that everyone has access to the local comic book shop. And sure, you can buy comic books there, but you can also get the games whose followers refer to as role-playing games, the most popular of which, of course, is the nefarious Dungeons & Dragons. In shops all around the country, people are free to walk in and buy this type of game their ticket into the twisted subculture of D&D. It's a hideous world of werewolves, gargoyles, demons, wraiths, minotaurs, and brownies. Yeah, me and my friends, we used to play D&D every Friday night. And what did you do during these games? Eat chips and stuff? We asked a local group of role players if we could join in their little ritual, and they told Overexposed yes, as long as we could roll up. A character sheet. I tried to roll up a character called a Halfling, but was unsuccessful, as I could not figure out the strange and bizarre unorthodox rules to the game. Thusly, I was not allowed to play. Apparently, this was some sort of strange and bizarre initiation rite I was unable to figure out. However, we... Hey. However, we did hear a second-hand account of what happened during the sessions, and we're able to recreate the events based on what we heard. And they're gonna attack you, so you need to roll surprise. Two. Okay, you're surprised. All right, one hits you, and then the other attacks you, and uh, he misses. <laughs> When did you start playing D&D? &D? Well, I never really played it because my friend told me it was a drug, you know, D&D &D like PCP. So what I did was I ripped the pages out of the rule book and rolled them up and I smoked them, but they were just paper. What do you think of D&D &D now? Pot's better. Yeah, I first got into D&D, &D, uh, like my friend said I should give it a try, so you know I did. And well, it, I really got into it, you know? And some of the guys there, they were, they were pretty normal. They could like play a game, you know, and take it okay. But some of the guys there, they'd like play a game and go really psycho on us. How do you mean psycho? Well, you know, like the chip dip for the chips? Well, they wouldn't just dip chips in it. They'd like dip other stuff like celery. And once even just their finger and they suck on it like, it was really annoying, you know, and like sometimes they, they throw the dice instead of just rolling normally and stuff, and then they would go over. Yes, and what of the sinister and strange dice used in these games? Unlike the dice from a more conventional game like Parker Brothers Monopoly, which are standard and square in shape, the cultish dice of Dungeons and Dragons are many faceted and shaped in all sorts of hellish forms. In the game, the dice are rolled to determine the outcome of future events, much like how ancient witches would throw down runes to predict their futures in satanic rituals of the body and soul. really satanic. Let's ask this expert. They most certainly are. Yes, but how can you tell? Well, if you look at the illustrations in this book, well, if you were to look at them, they'd look a lot like what you'd see in hell. These books are poisoning the the minds of our youth, they have no place in society. Uh, 
they're, they're just downright evil. I see. Would you like a lucky charm? <gasps> lucky charms? That, that's, that's witchcraft! Get out of my house, heathen! Work of Satan! I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, which way to the door? Door? <gasps> to be decent, fun-loving people, but after a few stray rolls of a D13 die, they find themselves to be evil puppets whose strings are pulled by Satan himself. Common store-bought games leading to devil worship. It could be your son or daughter. A powerful story. Tomorrow on Overexposed, an exclusive Devil Worship and Children's Board Games. Enter the strange and twisted realm of Forest Friends. <laughs> Spend the night in the forest of dawn! I must play the game, must play the game! Hungry, 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 hungry for souls! No, 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 no,